In times of emergency, drones can be a lifesaver. When there is a fire, for example, as this demonstration shows, heat-seeking cameras can give rescuers vital information on what's happening inside a building. I can now see that there is still a victim inside that room. And this is extremely powerful. This data allows the incident commander to assign resources to different areas. Rescue services from across the EU have come together at the Drones and Public Safety Summit in Brussels. Italian officials confirming drones helped in the aftermath of August Genoa Bridge collapse. We used the drones to produce panoramic 2D models to identify other targets where we could intervene so that we could optimize the planning of rescue operations. Despite how useful drones are, a lack of comprehensive EU regulations could hinder rescue operations. A proposal is now being worked on to harmonize legislation for civil drones. A lot of the companies within the value chain of uh, use space they have products, they may even have uh, solutions, but they can't go commercial right now. Once the legislation is fully out, up and running, um, they'll be able to open up the industry and do commercial business. Civil drone technology is also expected to create around 150,000 EU jobs by 2050.